G'day there, podcaster. This is the podcast name game. Andy, uh, you have a previous podcast up in front of you. You're going to give us the title and we're going to try and remember what that title was about. Mm, episode four. Yeah. I'd sniff his seat. <laughs> I'd sniff <Jesus>. his seat. <laughs> That's just... <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh man, who are we talking about there? Was it Bell talking about Daniel's donuts? Bell Is that what? just because you're looking at donuts out there? <laughs> well, no, it's because again, again we're recording this in November, and on the day we recorded this, we were ragging you for eating Daniel's donuts. Yeah. Uh, could have been me talking about um, a guy. No, I'd yeah. sniff his seat. Um, was it that, something like Zac Efron sat somewhere and we're like, oh, I'd sniff his seat. You, you are very, it's not <gasps> Zac Efron, but you're very close. Oh, yeah, okay, it's like Chris Hemsworth. Uh, it is Chris Hemsworth, yeah. Yeah, yeah so it's Chris Hemsworth is obviously somewhere. It was um, topical. Yeah. And, and then one of us has said, I'd sniff, I'd sniff his seat. seat. We, we spoke to, we, we did the topic, did you serve a celeb? And it was a cafe <laughs> person right. who served Chris Hemsworth. You met Chris Hemsworth. He's like a god in these parts. Yeah, he's a very nice man. What did he order? Um, he got a long black with a side of full cream milk and his wife got a dirty chai. Was he using all that milk? Um, I'm not sure. I didn't clear his table. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so don't act well, like I would have been, been sniffing the seat. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> interesting, interesting order. I don't know why you get a side of full cream milk. Like, just get it in there. You just, I don't know, he just tops it up as he goes. Seems a bit, seems a bit wanky. Remember that guy who got arrested for like sniffing people's bike seats? <laughs> No. <laughs> no. <laughs> There's a what? news story about him. He was like, he was like, literally like on the cover of the Sun. You know, there's like trashy mag, like trashy um papers over in the UK, and it was like the bike seat sniffer. Yes. And he was just like a, like a real weirdo. What? And he, he'd go around <laughs> sniffing, sniffing people's seats whilst they're in at work. Oh what God. crime is that? Like, obviously that's a, a, a wrong know. thing to do. But we're like, yeah. what, what, what is the charge? What is the charge? <laughs> Sniffing a seat. <laughs> a yeah. succulent Chinese meal. Like, what actually? It's a good question. Bike because, seat sniffer guy. Like, you can't... He's not actually doing anything wrong. He's just a bit of a weirdo. But you can't just arrest people. Well, he's doing something wrong because he's sniffing someone's seat. That's not... Yeah, but, is like, it, that's not... Is it, like, <laughs> <an invasion laughs> not hurting anyone. No one suffers Warning all that. cyclists. This man will sniff your bike seat. Look at him. Oh, yeah. If it, has, it, has ever a man <laughs> been out of central casting for bike seat sniffing? Bike seat perv bids 10K to sniff... Pippa's saddle. Have a look at the guy. Okay, so he's at, he, yeah, he's well, putting he's up not ten. Sharing his screen. He's yeah, so he's up... not. He didn't get in trouble for it. He's just saying. Oh, no, I, I think he did end up getting in trouble. Yeah. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> yeah. But he obviously listening to this at the moment. You need to Google that because you need to look at. He's put. He's put. Like. He's also put money up because there's this like. Um, yeah, there's this famous cyclist over in the UK, and he said, "Hey, I'll give you ten grand if you let me sniff your saddle." Yeah. I wonder if they took it. I don't know. I mean, why not? Yeah, You're like, well, yeah, if someone's like, give you 10 grand to sniff your bike seat, you, if they you give you to your cash. You literally don't have to do anything. Then again, I also would worry that <laughs> There's another article. that person might come and kill you after. No shame. Oh, doesn't leave Clinton that. has been up to his old tricks again. Oh, Clinton. <laughs> oh, Clinton. <laughs> not Clinton. Whoa, here we go. Seat sniffer sells kidney to buy Princess Di's bike. <laughs> it's the holy grail. He doesn't have her bike. Snurging. So oh, it's thrilled we, Clinton. Here's my question, and we'll go around the room. Whose uh, bike seat would you like to sniff? Hmm. Uh, That's just like. Oh, here we so go. An update. Nah. Seat sniff perv <laughs> sent to the loony bin. It's a bit sad. Oh, okay. That's it's just a fetish. Like, get over Poo it. Who smeared Clinton? Cracks up over. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's so all alive, hasn't he? Jeez. Oh, here um, we go. He was nicked for sniffing Nicki Minaj's bottom. Oh, now that's that's now we're getting too All right, close. We're gonna wrap this up, otherwise you're gonna keep reading headlines on the sun. <laughs> this Clinton guy. I feel like Andy, you have an answer for yours. <laughs> no, I, uh, just very quickly. Uh, also on that show, the Scomo tackle. Uh, we interviewed the guy that ate all the Big Macs. Big Mac guy. Oh, the guy with the ponytail. Yeah. Because uh, did he click? He clicked over like a million or something. He clicked over some crazy number. Yeah. Because he eats like. 10 a day or something uh, wild, right? Talk back. I destroyed my partner's blank and clumsy dads. Clumsy dads. Uh-huh. Not as not as good as the other show. Not as good as the Secret Society one. Yep. But yeah, you can't win them all, can you?